everybody and welcome back to my channel back again for another weekly vlog could i look any more attractive honestly i mean just ignore the mess that is this um but i've got my other asos parcel finally hermes is finally coming through um so let's open this i ordered this after i watched sophia and chintz's video because sophia had this top on and it was in my basket ages and i thought you know what i'm just gonna bite the bullet i'm just gonna buy it um let's see what they look like um of course i had to get them in both colors that they came in because i got that excited um so these are the asus design top with twist front in white and black um i think these are just going to be a staple that everyone has in the wardrobe fingers crossed the fit So this is what the top looks like. So it basically just likes a crop, looks like a crop t-shirt, but it's got a big cut on it and a twist at the front. I think this is going to look really nice. And I've also got it in black. Um, so I'm going to try this one on and show you what it will look like. Obviously, I would have to wear nipple covers with this, um, but I absolutely love it. It's just a staple. I can wear it with like joggers, um, shorts, jeans, anything. Um, and then obviously I've got the black one as well, which I'll quickly show you. So this is the black version. I think they're just going to go with everything. Um, apologies if you can hear roadworks going on. We've currently got about 10 billion vans at the top of the road doing roadworks. So if that's what you can hear in the background, I do apologise. I'm going to try to speak as loud as I can so you can hear me. Um, but today, it's currently Monday. Today we went to White Rose. We did a bit of shopping, um, which I've got a couple of bits of showing. I've got a misguided parcel I want to share with you as well. Um, apologies that I didn't actually vlog when I was out. I don't know why, but at the minute when I go into shops, it just feels like really hectic. Like I've got my mask on. I feel like it's just a bit, like I feel a bit anxious when I go shopping, like in person. This is why I'm doing all my shopping online because going shopping in person at the minute, it's too, it's too much. I'm just like, I don't, I don't like it. So I've not been filming it really because I've just been like, no, I've just been like getting, get out that's it and there's not really to film like i can't talk to you because i've got a mask on it's just anyway enough of that rant um, i'm going to show you what i got so i went to primark as always um, and i've been eyeing this jacket up at work for ages i've wanted one for honestly years um, and i saw it and i thought you know what bite the bullet and i'm going to buy it it's beautiful it's stunning is this jacket i'm so excited about it so it is a Apologies for the noise. <laughs> it is a Avia style leather jacket. This was an absolute bargain as well in Primark. Like this was £35. I got a size medium, which is a 12 to 40, and it fits exactly how I want it to. It's got a belt buckle at the bottom, which you can hear. But honestly, I'm so happy with this. It's furry all the way through. Like this fur, you can see it's all the way through. It's on the arms, on the inside, everywhere. Stunning. Got the fur on the sleeves fur up here and this is just stunning like this over any outfit in the autumn and winter is going to look insane um but yes absolutely obsessed with this and then we've got my misguided parcel most of this is my friend's birthday stuff, so I'm not actually going to show you that. But I did get two things for myself, of course, a hat to wow. Because they had a really good um, discount on, even though I'm not a student, my account still says I'm a student till 20. Still says I'm a student till 2021, so I've got to use it while I can. The first thing, um, this was one of the reasons I actually went and looked on this guide, obviously. My friend's present, but also I saw this on the misguided Instagram. It's Rosie Williams from love island we're wearing it and i thought oh my god it's beautiful is the ribbed button front crop top um, and it's so so pretty it's just like a staple but it's cute at the same time oh this is flipping cute so it's just this little square neck crop top but it's got these really cute buttons on it really really good quality ribbed material um and yeah i think this is just gonna look really really cute i mean it's not like i've got enough colours in this top already but I wear this kind of stuff all the time and I think with both them jackets that I've bought that and the checkered jacket that I got in my previous haul it's gonna go fab 
Um, and another thing I got from the Sky and Far myself was the twist front long sleeve crop top in the shape, in the colour black. Obviously, I literally live in black. Is the it's similar to when I showed the other day, um, but this one's long sleeve, so this is going to be better for this time of year. Again, just black staple piece, twist front, long sleeves, bish bash boss, going to look good on the boobs, so we're happy about that. I really want to just fill my wardrobe with like staple basics, like really good quality that are going to last me, um, that can literally go with everything and then build like certain pieces around them, hence why a lot of the things I've been buying are like basic staple pieces. I mean, I'd have to explain myself, but... If you're wondering why I was buying loads of the same stuff, it's because I'm stocked up. We'll stay in my wardrobe for a while, get years out of them. For now, I'm going to sit and I'm going to watch some YouTube because I feel like I've not watched my subscriptions in absolutely ages. So that's what I'm going to do. Good morning, everybody. So it's currently Tuesday today. Um, I've just taken some Instagram photos and done some TikToks, hence why I look very presentable. I mean, my hair is like four days old. I'm literally going to tie this up in a bun in a second, but I've got my new top on from misguided and i absolutely love it um makeup is looking good as well i need to go actually go get some more foundation so it's going to happen at some point this week um but today's on a chill day um and i'll see what i get up to another day another parcel oh i also it is the same day it's still tuesday but i changed my top i'm in this one from um sheen still got my ring light out i made to put that away but my opal parcel has just come and i want to share with you this dress because it is gorgeous like i'm so excited to wear this whenever the next time is that i'm actually going to be going outside <laughs> very excited about this dress i couldn't leave it it was beautiful and there was a sale so i got it cheaper than what i thought and i still got students cut on it as well so we love that is it just me or have they changed the color of the boxes because this pink is a lot lighter than what they originally were but i mean we all love a new poly box i'm very excited oh my god how cute is this it says for girls by girls love that Anyway, let's get onto the dress. I'm so excited. As you can see, it's actually colour. Woo! Chloe's actually going for something that's colourful. Is the sweetener green um, dress. I got it in a size 12. Fingers crossed this does fit. I think it will. I'm so excited about this. Can we also just appreciate how lovely this packaging is? Just obsessed with the whole packaging. So this is the dress. It's just this gorgeous sage green colour. It's got a square neck and then it ruffles and then at the back it's got like a low back and ruched bit and it crosses. If you can see, I'm going to try it on quickly now. We'll see. How stunning is this? I look at the back and it's long enough and um, like the arms are like, it's just really stunning fits perfectly you know what i'm so glad i got 12 because i think 14 would have been too big um but it ruches it's sage green it's square neck it's gorgeous i'm imagining this with like curly hair um like gold eyes i think this will look really nice oh i can't wait i hope i've got somewhere to wear this soon um yeah I feel all bad and bougie love this 10 out of 10 So it's a bit later on, I'm going to attempt to make this Cadbury brownie mix because I've had it in the cupboard for ages and I really want to make it. If you know me, you know I love brownies. Um, so we need egg, vegetable, brown tray, water and a hand whisk. So fingers crossed this goes okay. She did it! I'm gonna cook it now. Put it in the pan and then put it in the oven. Oh. 
so it is now Wednesday. Um, I make I made those brownies yesterday. I was so upset. I opened the oven and the brownies were like pristine condition. I literally took them out of the oven and they just deflated. And they were about like this thing. I thought they were going to be really thick, chunky um, brownies. But it must just be the pack because I literally followed it step by step. Like step by step. So I don't know. But yeah, everyone ate it and it's all gone now. So it must have been nice. Good morning. So it is currently... Thursday today, I didn't vlog anything yesterday because I literally didn't do anything like just sat in the house to be honest with you. Um, but it's a new day today. Today we're just doing some M&D bits. We need to go to a food shop. I'm going to my granddad's baby because it would have been his birthday today. And I need to get some more foundation because I am running low. Um, I'm, I'm wearing the same, I'm wearing this jumper that I got from Sister Z because I literally, I've been watching my vlogs back and I've literally worn this in like, all of them. But it's one of my favourite jumpers. So we're going to allow it, um, so I've got this on and then just some um, cycle shorts, comfy, cosy outfit. Um, but yeah, we're heading out soon. I thought I'd do a little curly pony today, I thought why not, something different. <laughs> so I am back home now, we went out, we did the food shop, I went to my granddad's grave, obviously I'm not going to so Max, it's a private, personal thing. Back now, uh, I want to show you something that I got for Halloween. I know we're still a month away, but I'm getting really excited. As soon as September hits, I'm like, Halloween. If you didn't know, I love Halloween and Christmas. Um, this year, so I don't know what's going to be happening because of COVID. I don't know if we're going to be able to go out or not. One of my friends was wanting to have a house party, so we'll see. I've got an idea in my head of what outfit I want to wear this year, like what I'm going to dress as. I've got one piece of it, but obviously I'm still waiting to buy the other things just in case it's not going to happen. Um, but in the case it's not going to happen and I'm probably just going to be sat in my room and watching because I've actually booked Halloween weekend off just in case. But if we can't go out, I'm going to be sat... Um, if we can't go out, I'm going to be sat in my room watching Halloween films all day um, and I'm going to be wearing this to out of the festivities. Um, so it's I got actually got this off eBay. I was watching Zola's vlog and she had it on in it and i was like oh my god i'm obsessed like i need it so it's from the brand smart it's from the seller smarty pants on ebay and it is the sanderson sisters classic retro hocus pocus halloween movie inspired t-shirt are you ready i don't think you were ready for this look at it i'm absolutely obsessed so if you didn't know it's hocus pocus where have you been living under a rock if you've not seen hocus pocus but yeah, it's got the Sanderson sisters on it. It's got Binks on it. And it's got Billy on it as well. I can't even hold it up. It's got Billy on it as well. I just absolutely love it. I just love the graphic, the graphic of it. I just think it's so nice. I got it in a large, obviously, because I like my t-shirts bigger. But this is going to be coming out every year now. Every year on Halloween, I'm going to be repping this. I'm obsessed. Um, but yes, that came so quick. I literally only ordered this the other day. It's already come, so... Well done eBay. So I am going to enter today's video here for you guys because I'm not doing much else at the minute. Just catching up on the news as you can hear in the background. But yes, anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.